What is something done to Dominic? I'm gonna do everything in my power to help you. I can't believe I'm your father. It's... I'm gonna, I'm gonna figure out a way to make this right. Taking so long. They, they said they were gonna. I can't do this to him right now while he's fighting for his life. I think you should wait outside. No, I'll go ahead and stay. Your son's vitals haven't stabilized. I'll need to examine him further without an audience. Okay. We're leaving. Time to talk to him about being his father. I just wanted to let him know that he, I'm not going to hurt him. And you think this was you, that information couldn't wait? He woke up. He looked at me. He, he had panic in his eyes. I was just trying to calm him down. What's the big by, deal? By confronting him with this kind of shock right now, Look, Sonny. I get it that I kept this secret for a lot of years, so it is on me that it could even get to the point where you would shoot your own son. But you, you have got to back off. He can't okay. deal with this. Okay, you have lied to me for over 20 years about my son. I'm not going to leave him now. Did Sonny kill Dominic? I just came from Sonny's and no one was there. All I found were Dominic's coat and tie covered in blood, so what happened? I don't know. No, don't lie! Sonny obviously shot Dominic. Did he kill him? Dad likes Dominic. He would never shoot him. Sonny found out Dominic's an undercover cop, didn't he? Dominic's a cop? Jason, what's going on? So that's why Sonny wasn't at the christening. He set a trap and Dominic walked right into it. So where are they, Jason? Did he kill him and drag his body somewhere where no one will find oh, it? Dude, I, don't, I don't know what happened. Okay, fine, then I'm going to the hospital because maybe I'm wrong. Maybe there was an accident and Dominic is there. But if he is not there, the next place that I'm going is to the police and tell them everything that I know about you and Sonny and your business. If Dominic is dead, I hope that you and Sonny burn in hell. I thought we trusted each other. Now I find out you've been lying to my face that we, we've had, we haven't had, had a you job know, together you, all these years. You know damn well that I had my reasons. And this is not the time or the place to go in anyway. Dante's in that hospital bed because you never told me the truth. No, I'm not the guy that shoots people to get in my way. All I care about right now is giving our son the best possible chance to survive, and that's what you got to do, too. And you can't go overloading him with stress while he's fighting you for his life. You had every opportunity to tell me. And instead, it was the same old lies. I'd ask you who the father was, and you'd say, it was this guy, that guy, this... I'm talking about right? this right now. Of course you're not. What was so terrible that you couldn't tell me the truth, that you denied Dante a father? Was it so horrible? To raise a child with me? Did you hate me that much? I hated the life that you chose. I didn't want my kid to have any part of that. But you, you let Dante target me as an undercover cop knowing how dangerous that was. If you just told the truth, we wouldn't be in this tragedy. All right, fine. Sonny, it's all on me, okay? It's my fault. Just, just unload on me another time because right now I'm going to get my son through this. So you just need to get out of my face. Just go. Where do you get off telling me to get out of your face? When you've been lying to me about my son. Sonny, you can't do this. You are gonna make it through this, Dante. I know I probably sound like a broken record with that, right? But you know I'm a real strong believer in positive reinforcement, right? I believe that the, that the very best is possible. And my proof of that is you. I love you so much. I still remember when I first found out that I was pregnant with you. I was so scared. I just felt so terrified and so alone. Right up until that minute where they, where they put you in my arms. It was like my whole life lit up. Like God, like God flipped the switch. You have brought.
brought so much joy into my life. And you're gonna keep on doing that. I know that. You're gonna get through this. You are gonna be fine. You can make everything right. How's he doing? If you hit on loan on me, I I understand, John, but I gotta respectfully ask you to just do it another time. I've gotta be with my son right now. Okay. I mean Sonny's son too, right? Well, at least now I understand all the lies you told him why you told them. I'm not here to unload on you, Olivia. I'm here to be by your side. If you want me. So, I know you're upset, but Olivia is still Dante's mother, and you need to respect that. I shot my son. This wouldn't have happened if Olivia had just told me the truth. I know that, and believe me, she does too, but you're not going to solve anything tonight. You know, when I first started working with Dante, I always... I always felt there was something there. You know, like, the ways we were alike. First time he came through the door, he was cocky, and he said to me, you gotta hire me. And I liked him, right off the bat. When Olivia first told me he was my son, what I felt, I was shocked, and then I wondered, why didn't I see it myself? Now he's in that hospital bed shot by my own hand. If Dante recovers, you'll have plenty of time to work everything out. Robin, what if he dies and I killed my own son? Matt, has Dominic Parley been admitted? Yeah, the Levy suffered a gunshot wound to the chest and he's critical right now. So he's gonna be going into surgery as soon as we have him stabilized. good qualities and none of the bad ones. I swear, the kid was a joy from the moment he was born. You know, it was, it sounds corny, I know, but it was like that song, You and Me Against the World. It was like us. You know, I just felt complete knowing that I had such a fine son and I raised such a good man. And I swear that I would always do right by him. Come on, don't beat yourself up. I was so deluded. God, I just, I deluded myself. Thinking that I could find some way for him to get out of this mess without him ever knowing that Sonny was his father. I mean, I, I couldn't see a solution. I, there, there was no way to predict how Sonny would act. When he found out, I mean, turns out the solution was staring me in the face the whole time. It was called the truth. Sonny's his father. That's right. How's he doing? They're trying to get him stabilized before they take him into surgery. You know, he's been in and out of consciousness. He asked for you. 